Morning, everybody. Hope y'all are doing well. A little sprinkling a little bit down here, but not too bad. I think it's going to be a rather nice day. I hope it's nice where y'all are. I got a little treat for you this morning. Pat sent me a video from Judge uh, Simpson's court. We got a guy that uh, I sound like he's trying to rep represent himself and doing poorly. Now I'll put it that way. When we get done with that one, we got a video from Miss uh, Miss Jojo that I think y'all enjoy. A gentleman who's uh, well, he thinks he's tougher than he is. So uh, let's give these a watch. One thing I would like to say, um, I'd like to get back to doing more of the court videos. So if uh, if y'all come across any good court videos, I'd rather get them from the original court if possible. Um, if y'all come across any of those, please send me those. I sure would do appreciate it. Hey, just before I want to talk about this, he's a dollar. You may be seated. So we're waiting for the gentleman to be brought in. There he is. That's called the case of the people versus Patrick Bernard Thorns. Council, state your appearances, please. Right. Assistant Prosecuting Attorney Morgan Barroso on behalf of the people. Mark Brown, Deputy Chief Public Defender, appearing with and on behalf of Mr. Patrick Thorns. Mr. Thorns, state your name the record. How you doing, Mr. Sims? Patrick Thorns, here on behalf of Patrick Thorns. Um, okay. Thank you. Date and time set for a preliminary examination. Are the people ready? Are the parties ready to proceed? Yes, Your Honor. We are ready to proceed. Call your first oh, witness. We're ready to proceed. You want to cross me? Okay. What do you want? How you doing today, I'm great. Thank you. Uh, I was I was arriving on the 29th of uh, December, I believe. 28th? I mean, what? I was around on the 28th and 29th of December. Last time I seen you, um, we had an argument, I believe, Miss um, Coop, Coop, or Coop, or Spoon, I'm sorry, with my public attorney. Mm -hmm. You don't tell me that. <laughs> uh, West, I had a couple of things that I, I noticed when I went to the law library, but I'd like to state on the record. Uh, the uh, prosecution asked for a two week adjournment um, outside, of, outside of the 12 day um, preliminary examination. Weston versus, I mean, Weston. Um, oh my God, I'm sure. Weston. You got a jailhouse lawyer. Remedy. It's uh, MCL 7.66. I believe you should get in contact with the victim and go to get in contact with the victim. Um, we get on the 23rd, we got an adjournment because uh, the weather. But I was outside of my school day, uh, preliminary examination. And I'm okay, so I'll tell you what we can do. If you want to do it this way, we can do that. I'll set it for tomorrow. I'll just have the people prepare new information. No, it's fine. I, wanted and to then, I just wanted to see if that information was correct, sir. If what information was correct? My attorney was aware of this. I, I didn't know, but there was supposed to be a victim in this matter. This is a hearsay matter. Uh, we could proceed. I just wanted it to be stated on the record. That's all. I so, are you objecting to the timelines? Because I'm not going to go ahead. I mean, it, I don't know that the adjournment that was originally asked for was asked for by the people. I have it attributable to the defendant. No, I think Ms. Coons asked for the adjournment. When it was uh, yeah. no, sir, she asked for the 16th. We gave her the 23rd because the prosecution stood and wanted to bring in witness, right? That would have been on five days, that's why. And then it was so I set it for the next available date, which was the 23rd. Also, oh, the storm, 
and that the court would find was good cause to adjourn the proceedings. No court proceedings were going on those days. The court was closed. So it's okay. I want to make sure that it was understood that I was arraigned on the 28th or the 29th and that the court ruled. Okay, Mr. Thorns, let me just tell you. Are you objecting to it? Because I will make a full record as to why it is set in this way. And for the record, I have explained all of this to Mr. Thorns. I've made it clear to him that he is not. We can proceed, Mark. I mean, if you're going to just go ahead, we're going to just do whatever. Go ahead. Do whatever. I know that it was it was it was adjourned because the, pro the prosecution wanted uh, that later date so that they can get <laughs> over two dates. He couldn't do it in five. I gave the next date, which was within the time limits. Did that, oh, no, the and then well, it was twelve days outside of the problem. Okay, if you're objecting, here's what we're going to do. No, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to I'm going to adjourn it to tomorrow over the defendant's objection. You can file a new information. It starts over. He doesn't get any credit for the time that he's been in. That's how we're going to do it. I'm done. You can't keep talking to me on this. So this is adjourned to tomorrow at give me no, I'll adjourn it. Yeah, I'll adjourn it to tomorrow special time. You can have an imp you can have a new case prepared. I will I will make some calls tonight and make sure that, that happens. <sighs> so they came in there uh wanting to play games on what's going on, why and everything as far as the time and come to find out his side's the one that's been delaying it. Um silly. I'll try to catch that today. Sometime, if I can find it, uh, I'm curious to see what happens when him uh, representing himself. Okay, let's get on to the next. Did you not hear that? I did hear that. This comes from Vigilant Cam. I'll have a link to the original video in the description. Y'all give him some love. My man, now I'm telling you to step out. Stop. Give me a breathalyzer because I'm clean. Don't. Why are you arguing with me? I'm not, get away stop. from me. Sir. What are you doing? Get, All right. Get some hands off hey. me. I am not okay. Will you stop pulling okay. my arm? Can I get me. off the we'll ground? Get on March 10th, 2023, police arrive on the scene in Batavia, Illinois. They're responding to a complaint about the improper use of a traffic lane. At the scene, Officer Moorhart pulls James E. Kramer, age 64, over for failing to maintain his lane. Moorhart approaches the window with his flashlight and asks the suspect to step out of the car so he can talk to him. When the officer asks to see his driver's license, Kramer quickly turns from uncooperative to confrontational. Silly. Like, what is he on? What's going on? Does it open? Hey, can I just open this? All right. I need to talk to you properly, so how about you step out of the car so we can talk real quick? Uh, what are you guys talking about? I want to talk about your driving, so and now I'm ordering you to step out. So can you step out for you, please? Yeah, because I need to talk to you. I can't talk to you through here because it's way too complicated. Let me just step out. My man, now I'm telling you to step out. I'm telling you to step out. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. But it's a safety thing for me, so let me have you step out so we can talk. This is going to be a real easy conversation, I promise you. You're driving in and out of your lane. You're not maintaining your lane since um, Main Street in Batavia. That's the reason I'm pulling you over, okay? So step out so we can talk about this. I'm not going to give you a driver's license. You haven't really asked for that yet. I do need a driver's license. Well, no, let's talk about what you have to talk about. This isn't a game, no, all right? No, I agree. It's give not. me your driver's You're license You're the one that right turned on your life. And you, bring, bring your squad here, man. Bring your squad here. I need your driver's license. For what? For the traffic violation that of I of what I of improper lane usage, I've explained exact, this to you already. Exactly what I, I, I went over the W line for a second. Yeah, for a second. A, a couple of times. Give me a breathalyzer because I'm clean, don't man. Don't breathe on I me get, like that. I just got off work. Don't breathe on me like well, that. Get up, well, then I'll have to wear a mask. Do not breathe on me like you're, that. You're it's suggesting that I'm drunk. No, I'm not. But what I'm saying is that you're improperly driving, and I noticed it three to four times until we got to this area. So I need your driver's license. Video. I need your driver's license. Is it on video? But why are you arguing with me? I'm not, You're arguing I'm not, with me. It's a yes or a no question. There is no video because we don't have squad videos. No, that's too freaking bad because, because, three, because four, I don't agree with you. I said I did it once. I did it once. You said it three, four times. Yeah, three or four times. Yeah, well, then what should I do? I need your driver's license. What should license. I do? Do this, friend? I can stare at you and, and do that at the same time. A, B, C, D, E, F, T, H, I, J, K, L, M, P. What's your issue? All right? What, what is it you want? What's your issue? 
that I'm not doing anything Stop wrong. Stop yelling and getting close to me like that. I'm talking to you. I'm trying to get my car leave. No, you're not. You need to call, call your sergeant. Get away stop. from me, sir. What are you doing? All yeah. right. Hey, right. stop. Stop it. Right now. You, you told me to ground, and I will. Okay. Get to the ground right now. Get to the ground right now. All right, stop. All right. I will. Stop. I will. Get your hands off me. You guys are dicks. Relax his hand, buddy. Just go. Relax his hand. What am I being accustomed for? You're walking away from us while I'm trying to talk to you and making this difficult. I will give you my driver's license. I asked for it to you multiple times. In your pocket. All right, you're stood. Truck on 354. I got north of the road with you. Can I get off the ground? We'll get handcuffs right now. This is ridiculous. You you made this ridiculous from the get-go, man. Can I get off the ground? Come on, Jack. Hey, I'm trying to get you in handcuffs. I'm trying to get you in handcuffs. I'm in the dirt. I can't breathe. You moron. Let me get up and get my face out of the dirt. You jag off. Hey, Let me up. Moving. Let me up. God damn it. You're hurting my arm. Okay. You're hurting my I'm gonna arm. Sit you okay? I'm going to sit you up. You're a dick. Yeah, you sir. Why are you grabbing me? Because. Chill out. Because yeah. you're the one that threw me to the ground. Yeah. Now you have it. Will you stop pulling okay. my arm? Will you stop? You've been a dick. You have been a dick. All this for a traffic stop, right? Exactly. All, yeah. all this I didn't get all dirty because I did. All, all this for a silly violation. Does you want me to stand up now? You can sit down now. You, you jag off. I will have a lawyer on phone, on phone tomorrow. Okay. I didn't do any violation. You okay? You, you want, want, No, I am not okay. Is and your there's no. Okay? What? Your shoulder's okay? You don't need an ambulance or anything like that? Let's make sure you're all right. You good? I don't give a f when you hear. Okay. Let me stand up. Let stay on the Let ground. Let go of me. Just stay in the ground. You, know, you got my face all dirty, you prick. Well, don't fight with the police. Your face Can I get up? No, you're going to sit down until so you're told to stand oh, up. Nice to see you. you need to write a ticket and let me go on my way. That You've been my, a jag off all day. That was my whole intention. I promise you that. My whole and now, intention, what, now what are your intentions? You see how you were acting to me? I could have rested. I put your handcuffs way earlier while you always spit on my face. Remember that? No, I don't. Yeah. I don't have any teeth in my mouth, so when I talk, maybe stuff flies out of my mouth. Uh -huh. but, but you call that spitting? No, I'm not saying. I'm not even going to. Hey, you're going to pay the dental work, sir? Okay. Call off. That's fine. I will talk to your sergeant. Please. I, will love I, that. I don't have a problem. I will love that. I'll go right to the precinct. Look at my clothes. Look yeah. at my face, you prick. Chill out. I was giving you my driver's license. No, you weren't. Yes, I was. Well, that's on camera because you're talking about cameras, right? Yeah, I and I had my camera. wallet in my hand, dude. Trying on three ball four. I got a 27 by five. I'm getting up. Sorry, I was trying to get on. Uh, yeah, no good. reason for me to be in here. Stop freezing. Your life is not in danger. Relax. Stupid. It's so unnecessary. So that foolish. F you, you ugly. F you got me out of the dirt. You dragged your own ass in the dirt. I know. I did. Because you said I swerved into the lane. Yeah, you did. You know what? I gave you a breathalyzer. I asked you if you wanted to. We're gonna put you in the back of my squad car, okay? So what are you gonna do? Yeah. You're standing up now. You have wishes granted. For what? You think I'm even precinct? Let's go. Where am I going? Get the back of my squad car. It might be interested. We're gonna figure that out real quick. Dude, I'm not hey. answering any questions. Stop. Yes. I don't, have to. don't talk to him. You're talking to me. Take a seat. Well, well, then you, then right you answer the question. Stay right there. Hold on. Stay right here. Can you please take the cops off my wrist? No, you're under arrest. Mm. For what? One for resisting. That wasn't and, resisting. And you clearly have the identification when I asked you multiple times. I was and giving it to you. Arguing, and look how many squads you got here. You're arguing like it's not a big deal. And you see this whole thing. Because yeah. you said, said what? That, I, that I did it three, four times. I asked you if that was on video. Turn around. Stop. Turn around, dude. For what? You can look at my glasses. You have no right to search me. I'm gonna sit in the back of my squad car, so you have to yeah, you have For to. what? That's my knife for cutting boxes open. You're dropping oh. my money on the f ground. Take a seat. Your money will go with you, don't worry. Take a seat. You. Take a seat. Fuck you. Hey, silly. I am sitting down. Good. Let me get my shoe on. Yes. You have no reason to do you have no reason to search my car. Mm -hmm. Get all his money because he'll come to me in about that. Let me talk. Hey, to listen, you. man. I'm no. homeless. You understand that? What do you What do you got to say? What do you got to say? I'm sorry that I acted rudely. I appreciate my, that. My, I, listen to me. Okay, me go out. ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. My driver, uh, the front window, mm -hmm. they were both broken. 
yeah. from some gangbangers in Chicago. I just replaced that glass. The passenger side isn't completely fixed. It wouldn't go down when I was trying to lower it. So when you were saying it was inconvenient to talk through the back window, yes, I was being a dick, man, but it, it really, did my face need to be thrown in the dirt? Come on, I was trying to oh, give you my driver's license when your partner showed up. You, and you absolutely did not. I wasn't no. trying to fight you, man. I wasn't. I, I'll say this. Kramer, right? That's the last name? Kramer? James, yeah. All right. I appreciate the apology. I do. However, everything that we did was escalated solely because of you, okay? Yes. I'm not trying to get you riled up. I'm not going to disrespect you. Yeah, it I sucks mean, that we both I got in the dirt. You, you were kind of... I was just I, I, asking right, you're you. You're just doing your job, man. I'm sorry, okay? I appreciate the apology. No, we just got to do paperwork. I want to get going. Can but I please get the handcuffs off? We're going to be back at PD and we'll, we'll go from there, okay? What? I appreciate the apology. I'm going to respect you. You're going to be uh, back at PD? Yeah, you're getting charges, man, for what you did. And so I'm getting locked up so tonight? You'll be able to get out. You're not going to stay anywhere tonight. What's going on with my car? It's going to get towed, oh. okay? I can't afford that, man. Please let me... If I didn't make it quick, really, we have 1 mil 95. I want to take it back to the PD and route now. Is somebody can't drive my car, can I drive it myself? I swear to God, I'm not going anywhere. I can't afford a tow truck. <clears throat> can it just stay there locked up or something? It can't You're be. Not You're not talking to me. I, I hear you, man. I do. I can't afford a tow. I, I'm sorry, man. I'm not, I don't know what to tell you more than what no, I just told you. you don't know how it is. You're forcing me to, you're forcing me. Come on, I asked for a favor. Well, you obviously could drive the car. We can't do that, I'm sorry. Sorry? We can't, we can't do that. Well, then you could have let me drive. I'm not intoxicated. I, I, yeah, I know. I, at this point, well, I don't think you're intoxicated. cost me, besides whatever charges I'm getting, I've got to pay for a tow. I'm homeless. Did you not hear that? I did hear that. Can they just leave the thing parked for an hour? I'll be back there. I'm asking for some grace. I understand that, man. We're past I that. I barely hear you because I'm not a net what I'm hearing to start with. I know. We're past that at this point, okay? Sorry? But we are that, past, that, that, yes. Okay. We are past that. That's uh, 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 very hard to hear. Okay. Give us two, give us two minutes. Can... Two minutes. We'll be at the PD. Two minutes. Just, I don't quite understand what you're saying. Okay. Just hold on, all right? I'm asking for a huge favor for you folks. I'm homeless. Does that matter to anybody in this world? Is yes, it's a stereotype of people that maybe sit at the park and get drunk all day and are obnoxious. I had a long day. I worked a long shift. And I just got off. I worked a double tonight. And you, you think I got money to just throw away on a tow? You shouldn't have acted up. I tried to get my car repaired. It was just in a wreck. Gangbangers shot my windows off. I got a piece of lead in my arm. He could check the records in Chicago records. You know, I thought that maybe I was speeding was the reason you pulled me over. I was just keeping up with the traffic. When, it, when you saw me swerve, it was because I was eating a piece of cake. I took my eyes off the road for a second, man. And now you're going to throw in a resisting arrest on me? Yeah. Wonder why no, I was cursing you out. resisting arrest. Why? I'm serious. You wonder why? Sure, why? You, you sleep at night? I said you were going inside in and out of your lane. Okay, well, excuse me for 
describing that in a different word because because what I was doing, what you described, would be erratic. Do you agree or not? Do not. Now here's the no. deal. I think I you're in court. Three, four times it happened once. I was eating a piece of cake. I just got off my shift, and they have no right to search my car back there. I'll let you know that. My phone, everything's in that car. How can I even call for an Uber to get a tow truck? Your huh? fo your phone's in the car. Duh. Hey, hey, chill out. I'm gonna help you out. You want me to get your phone? I don't have to. You want me to get your phone or not? Dude. Hey, no, listen. Listen to me. Car. Listen to me. Do you want me to help you or not? Because no. right now, I'm gonna ask the officer that's there to grab your phone for you. So you're gonna tone it down a little bit. Talk to me with some respect. The same way I'm. No, listen to me. Listen to me. Hey, listen to me. I'm gonna treat you with respect as much as I possibly can. Okay, so listen to me. Stop talking. You can't. Do you want your phone or not? Of course I do. So where is your phone, and what kind of I phone do you have? It's a Samsung. I don't okay. know. Okay, all right, chill out. It could have been in my hands when you Hey, Robinson. Me out of dirt. Lord, I don't know. Stop talking. I'm talking to my officer. Hey, Robinson, I'm five. Can somebody please bring my car here, man? I'm begging you. Three Paul one from three Paul four. I'm begging you. I'm trying to help him. Can you check the vehicle for my Rusty's phone? It says it's a Samsung. If you can do that and grab that for me, please, thank you. Let me put my gun away real quick. Yeah, good. Yeah, I should be fine. But I'm going to talk to him before he gets out the car. All right, James. Let me make myself very clear. I let you say whatever you want to me on the way on the way here. I'm doing you a favor out of you mother me the whole time. And called me names and all that you stuff. Listen, you listen. Threw me in the dirt. I am. Listen. And, I, and I'm responding, but I said you threw me in the dirt. Look at my face. Yeah. Look at my face. I sir. can tell my officer right now and not get your phone. You can be. Do you that's, want me to do that? That's, no, that's your prerogative. Do you want me to do that? I'm, I'm yeah. respecting you and listening to you. You're and not. You're whatever. I want to make then this as smooth as possible. To Just shut up and not respond okay. to what you have to say. That's yeah. fine. There's not going to be any talking to you. That's fine. So yeah. I'll, get your, I'll get your phone as that's the last sign of grace that you want from me, and that's it. So step out. Yeah. What choice do I have? You, you're gonna leave me. You're gonna let me free with no idea where my where my car is. Where my, you got my wallet? But but guess what? James Kramer was arrested for obstructing and resisting a police officer. He was released on an individual bond. Un unbelievable! Unbelievable! That probably could have been just a warning. Just a, hey, you know, you okay? Yeah, you seem okay. Please pay a little more attention. Maybe quit it and cake. Instead, he turns it into an arrest. Then he whines about it. You know, I, I know things are tough. And I know that 150 bucks is probably hard for him to get his hands on. Understood. Then you'd think he'd act a little more caution and not scream and holler at the officers, not walk away from them. Go ahead and give them your ID. Be decent with them. Um, it, it doesn't help you when you have that kind of awful attitude. It, it sure doesn't. Um, again, I appreciate y'all sending me the videos. And again, if there's any court videos, the original court videos y'all could send, I would really appreciate it. I hope y'all have a great day and I'll see y'all again soon.